Hey okay, guys! Why are my Welcome back to a terror attack! And I kinda forget what we're we're doing. Oh yeah, we got right We got two auto miners set up right now and they're mining some uh uh carbite for us for our mission. So what do you say we go run and smash some rocks? I think I'll um I'm either going to swap out the weapons that we have on our current Geocortec or I'm going to make a smaller Geocortec and just have some mining equipment stuck on the front of it. I think that's what I'm going to do, just make a smaller tech so I can go around the uh, area fairly quickly without causing too much lag. And the first thing we get is... Laser connection stuck in the face. Not the face. Guys, I know you see those black squares on the screen. I I seriously do not know what those are. I seriously they're do not know what those are. The ancients are they're the grids of the ancients. Study rain rain down in sympathy. This guy's out of it. Quoting an Oni video. I don't even know what you're going on about anymore. Infants. Uh, why do I ask? So I'm just trying to get myself more confused. Yeah, that one. Uh, Geocore. Hey. Here we go. Am I ever ending quest to find all the weird toys I had as a kid? I'm looking up Hot Wheels. I think. I think what you call it, um, mainframe made a bunch of the shitty early 2000s Hot Wheels movies too. I think they made those as. You know what I know? Because they made all the Barbie movies and like that shit's owned by Mattel as well, so that makes sense. Yeah, that makes sense. Still recording? Yes. I have that as well. I knew that was gonna happen. Okay. Let's put this one down here. On a scale of one to ten, how out of it are you right now? Forty four. Dumb question. I should have figured that. Uh, it's a giraffe. Guys, this is gonna be one hell of an interesting video. I'm gonna say that much. <laughs> I'm just quoting fucking Patrick. I think you could have worded that a, a little bit better. Shut up. Hey, you said it, not me. <laughs> you brought it. <laughs> I'm a little bit out of it too myself, guys, so uh, be prepared for anything. Oh god. Hmm. This little mini miner city. <laughs> I don't even know. I 
think I have that one. Home improvement. I can't believe they had a home improvement set. That's amazing. There we go. Oh yeah, um, we got a resource, we got resource collection here, don't we? Yes, we do. There we go. That's good, that's just in case we come across any, um, resources that we can pick up. Master Harvester, here we go. Master! Master! Yeah, in case we come across any, um, resource veins. And... Wow, that was instantaneous? What? Good lord. Instant transmission. Like a Dragon Ball. Now I got the song, was it uh, Controlling Transmission from Killer Instinct, a uh, soundtrack? I don't know why. Uh, I don't remember which one that is. I may listen to the new KI soundtrack, it's fucking good. And for anyone wondering, that was fast. But yeah, I, I'm not sure if I still have it. But I did have the legit, um, uh, OST of uh, K the original Ki. I had the uh, the hard copy CD. Dude, yeah. Rare used to, well, they used to fucking put out, like, fucking CDs with their games and shit. Remember fucking DK Jams? Yeah, it was called The Killer Cuts. I don't know what yeah. one of the songs is in my head right now. There was Killer Cuts, and there was DK Jams. Both ending with a Z, because that was the style at the time. Yup. In the 90s, place all your C's for K's. Place all your S's and C's Whoa. and shove an X in there wherever you can. Yep. That was the 90s. And, and if it wasn't that, it was going fast. Yep. There you go fast. Go faster, faster, go fucking faster. Yep. That shit is better than people give it credit for. It was not a bad show. I think they just hate it on for the for who dubbed it. But the thing is this: <laughs> if four kids didn't dub it, we probably wouldn't have. Um. People, see, people forget that. Yeah, we people probably wouldn't that. have Mike Pollock voicing Eggman right now. So, think no, of it that way. People don't realize that if four kids didn't do the dubs they did, would we have even seen these shows, gotten into them, and learned to like them at all? Hmm. Like, you gotta think of it like that. Like, yeah, they may not be the highest quality of those dubs, but it's how we watched them, and then we later found the better versions and got into different animes and stuff. So, you know, as bad as their dubs were, they were, you know, they got kids to watch it, they got kids into it. Hey, they were effective. Sure. And like hell, like the Yu-Gi-Oh dub was terrible, but look how fucking popular it was. Well, it's just stupid way Season it looks one was, I mean, Season 1 was really bad. Visible guns of anyone? Do we even need to go on about the uh, One Piece hammer? I don't think so. I want. I want a replica of that because it's so fucking stupid. That is the dumbest thing I've ever seen, but I want. And let's not forget. Jellyfield are my favorite. Oh God! Jellyfield, don't I? You forget Pokemon was for kids too. A lot of people forget that they did. They did it too. I think people. I like think that's one thing people want to forget. 
Except for the meme factor. Jelly filled in my favorite. Nothing beats a jelly filled up. I, I mean, even thought it was weird. I, I mean, referred to Onigiri as burgers before too. I swear there was an episode where Ash called it a burger. I'm not even joking. I know this happened. People, try to find that. Please, we need a new one. We need a new meme. Cause dude, that shit was ridiculous. And that was the thing. Four kids basically scrubbed any Asian Oh references. yes. Uh, Venture, Venture, where are you? Venture... Kids don't want to know about other cultures. Fuck that. Venture, like, move out. It's like fucking Revelations Persona, the first Persona game. Hmm. How, like, they butched it. Turned one of the fucking characters, like, they whitewashed everyone. And turned another kid black. So they have a more relatable cast. Removed like an entire route of the game. Changed all the dialogue around, and it was a fucking mess. That's right there. Friggin' kit box is right here. Right yes. Man. Great up. That's why we're lucky, fucking, um... Hello, Grade um, 2. Transformers... R.I.D., like, the original R.I.D. was so good, because... It, yeah, it's a cheesy 90s anime dub, but it's one of the better cheesy 90s anime dubs. Like, it's better than most, honestly. Of the era. It's still got some of that, you know... Oh. 90s dub player, but... You poor Ted. Miss me just gives a character. Yes. I'm yes. glad... I'm glad we got our... grade up in, um... What's that part of this? Ah, uh, Venture. Is that something I was honestly waiting for? You lost me again. Cartoons. I watched way too many cartoons as a child. That's my problem. A lot more than what I've seen. Apparently. Right. I've seen a like fucking every time I see a black truck, I just think Nemesis Prime. Whoops. And me. Did you say that for whenever you play that whatchamacallit? Yes, if I'm wondering, when I play Sonic Generations, there's a, there's a piece of music called, um, it's for the, um, the, uh, truck chase, uh, section in Studio Escape. And the piece of music is literally called Mad Convoy Race. And the thing is, for, for you Transformers fans out there, Convoy is the Japanese name for Optimus Prime. Prime. As well as Nemesis Prime or any other Prime oriented characters. Yeah, And the thing is. Convoy. Convoy. And the thing is. It's a black semi truck. So, yeah, that's pretty much Nemesis. Or Scourge. Wait, like was Scourge. was Scourge called Convoy in the Japanese one? I have no idea. Because if it was, then that would also make sense. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! 
Move it, move it. <laughs> I'm way too fast for the gas. <laughs> Whoops. I'm gonna let that fr that friggin' uh, initial D sound. Gas, gas, gas. Good lord. I should have done the gas too much. How the fuck know initial D? Um, because... I came across that- I came across that song in a meme and I just started listening to it like mad. Mad. That soundtrack is weird to catchy. Which is why I couldn't just stop listening to that song. Judge me, judge me all you want, haters, but that, so that song's catchy. Plus it, plus it got a good beat, too. Haters gonna hate. Yep. yep. Skaters are going to skate. Hey, why aren't you skating? Because I, I can't fucking, I have no, I have no balance. And I would hurt myself bad. Dude, I wanted to skate when I was a kid, but I never got the opportunity. I can remember when I was uh, younger, I had like a, um, was it, I had like, I had a miniature, uh, board. I, I think it was about, I think it was about, mm, say... That long? I think it was about like a foot, like a foot, foot and a half long. It wasn't that long, but still. I think it was like a a, a beginner's board or something really small. And yeah, I had a legitimate skateboard. It's cool too. Didn't do it. Didn't do much with it though. And I, and I know for sure as hell that I wouldn't be able to pull off any good stunts on tour because I'm no Tony Hawk. <sighs> Ow! <laughs> just, ran, <laughs> just ran right into the Geocore tires. Okay. You're right down there, um, uh, GSO. GSO build is just down there in the crevice, just sitting. I need to move It is a different one. It's over here. This is the area where Mission we had to do the last episode. So this one's another... This one? Yeah, this one's another 40 meter one. What the hell? I'm gonna be confused. Are you serious? Oh. We cleared it perfectly and did it backwards. Whoops. Okay. Like we need to do that a second time. Ha! <laughs> ha! Uh -huh. Oh, mama. That is a Venture Mix stack silo. What is this? Oh, we got a magenta block. Oh, we got a repair bubble. Sweet. Oh, Venture Large Compressed Fuel Tank. I believe this... Wait, what does it say? A highly compressed fuel tank which will refuel relatively quickly too. I think it's the same as having... I'm not sure if it's two or four of these. I'm not sure. And yes, we got a Venture Reaper X1 flamethrower. May I need to say more? These things are awesome. I love the flamethrowers. Man, we're getting a good haul today for Venture. Okay. 
God, we almost got like a Mars rover thing going on. Two wheels in the front, six wheels in the back, something small, something light, something go right there really quick. Click, quick, yeah, click. I can't speak. I can't speak the English. English is hard. Maybe I should try le learning another language, but then if I were to try that, you guys wouldn't understand me. Unless you guys are native to that language, but still. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Oh. oh, we better oh. get you up out of that ditch. Here we go. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. I don't think we're going to get much power from these batteries, but it'll be worth something. There's nothing else. Oh! Well, let's go get this. So it's a, it's another crate day. Luke crate, anybody? <laughs> oh, yeah, Luke, Luke crate unbox in Teratech style. He got batteries on his back. So you guys see the green lights? Let me see if I can save them. Let's see if I can save them. So because the more Juco batteries we got, the better. Oh, there they are. Why on earth would you have Juco batteries stuck in your back like that? Stop moving. Don't shoot the batteries. Yes. More power. Stop moving. Gotcha. Okay. Try to knock the battery off. Oh shit. Don't destroy the battery, please. Thank you. Okay. I'm gonna try and quickly grab this grab this stuff. Put this here and then. Let's go fight an invader! Come on, hurry up! Hurry up! Hurry up! I think we got an extra 10 seconds to leave. As long as we don't fire a single. You guys, you see that? Top middle? That's a megaton! I want that! You guys are going to see why, if we can get it. The hell is on this? Oh! Those miniguns. Or is it... Uzi SMGs. We got it, we got it, we got it, we got it. Oh, hell yes. Guys? Let me show you something. You guys see the little three pound cannons? Right? Megaton. There's not really much I can say. <laughs> There's not really much more I can say about it. Other than this thing is going to get full of them. Yeah, I'm going to. Yeah, venture Uzi SMGs. What grade are they? What? What? <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> what grade is this? Whoops! We got higher grade items than we than what we can currently can get. Uh oh! Uh, this is possible. You can do this. You just can't buy them from the shop. And if they do, 
uh, appear up in the shop like if I ha a higher grade item appears in the shop than what your current grade is um, it said it was saying like a certain grade number is required I can't believe I actually managed to get this stuff I know it could be possibly it could be possibly considered a little bit cheaty but it's still awesome how is this? Just a re resource receiver. Is that a conveyor belt? No, it's just resource receivers. What the hell? Just small ones too. And for for you Transformers fans out there, I'm saying, I'm sorry to disappoint you, but I'm saying Megaton, not Megatron. Megatron. I don't want no freaking grade one resource collectors. Guys, just, just listen to Just listen. I'm gonna stick this up in the front middle and I want you guys to listen to that big thud. Thud. Just listen to that. Boom. Oh. It's just a big It's just a big set of fun. Boom. You know that, that things are gonna die. Globetrotter? Globetrotter, okay. Okay, you're just... Why is my... Why is our turret stent damaging you? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, are you just out of range? Oh god. <laughs> Shot like the whole game. And guys, I got about what? Seven of these put on my GSO creation on my own file. Lays waste to everything. <laughs> I even got some, um, some of the, uh, GSO missile launchers. <laughs> when I make builds in this game, my main purpose is to kick total ass. No, it's just... It's just... That's just a... Freaking... Standard machine gun stuck to our backs. I mean, don't get me wrong. The machine guns are good for starter items. As I said in a previous video. But once you... Once you get the lasers, you might as well just stick with them. Especially when you get the... Um, y, the Y-gauge stud lasers. They're, they're so much better. Basically, get the good stuff where you can and stick with it. Of course you stick with the good stuff. What the hell am I going on about? I'm Mario. Absolutely Mario. Oh. I'm not sure if you're eating or if you're doing that on purpose. I'm eating. Oh. I'm eating, uh, fruit loops without milk, because, fuck the polis. <laughs> Coming straight from the underground. Yes, I know that song. And the next lyrics is something that I'm never gonna say. Mm-hmm. Because it will go against my, um... Uh, oh my god. It will go against my first protocol. You, you Titanfall fans will recognize that reference. Where I say, what are you, a robot? Is it protocol one? Link to pilot. Protocol two, uphold the mission. And protocol three, pr protect the pilot. 
Yes, I've seen Titanfall 2 and the game is absolutely amazing. Which is why I got Titanfall Assault. And for anyone wondering, yes, I do play that game. On a regular basis. In case anyone was wondering. <coughs> oh. That heartburn almost made me vomit. But. Ugh. Heartburn is a pain in more ways than one. Oh, that mix solo is a great too. No, duh, we got it for delivery crate, dumbass. There's the Reaper X Wing flamethrower. And personally, well, there's there's two routes you could take. You go with the Venture Hellfire rifle if you want to go for something that has a lower fire. Well, something that is like the um. It's like the Grade 1 machine gun that has good range. But, um... It says your high rate of fire and medium range are reliable if on a park weapon. So if you want something with a bit longer range, go that way. But if you want to burn... Your enemies at close range... The flamethrower is the way to go. It says... This flamethrower is great for showing off to your friends whilst doing wheelies. It's not much good for, you know, fighting or mining or anything. Um. That last that last bit of sentence must have been must have been written by a tsundere or something. Because my know. God, does a kick ass! Yes, for anyone wondering, I used a flame throw before, and yeah, it's an ass kicker. How many resource receivers do we have anyway? Hmm. Wait, seriously? These two are the only ones we got? What the hell? Oh, that's the shop, dumbass. Ah, uh, GSO. 30! That's more like it. 30! Scrap these. Let's see what we get. Scrap these. Let's see what we get. Money! Yay! Money. Here we go. That's gonna get sold off. Oh, while we're here, let's um, let's grind up these blocks. Now, I was actually thinking about this on my own file. If you guys want us to build a tech just using these specialized blocks, let me know. Because having a a Having a, li a lime green uh, tech, I think that'll be pretty cool. Having a, a, the light gray of like Columbia would be pretty cool. The golden yellow here of the Eluxian, that would be pretty cool. But yeah, like I said, let me know. Let me know. Yeah, post that in the comments and I'll have a look. And for anyone wondering, yes, I do read comments and comment and comments. Yeah. I do read comments, and I do reply. That's something I always make sure I do. So I don't want to leave you guys hanging. Right, now we got a whole bunch of moolah coming in. And yes, I just said moolah. Don't freaking judge me. I love the GSO ones because they well they carry the most amount of resources in them. They carry a they carry 120 each, and which means well, they're worth a metric load of money. 
I do need a I do need to make a section for um resources, don't I? Wait a minute, uh resource. Wow, we only got one large receiver? What the hell? That's a little bit new. No, I don't wanna send it to the inventory, leave me alone. There we go. Park you there. Sorry turret. I didn't mean to get in your way, man. Yeah, you can you continue wiggling your way. Oh, wiggling, yeah, wiggling away. Uh, okay, fix tanker. Do this real quick. Ah, uh, I guess I might as well have this here. And the money is just gonna continue going up. Okay, and we got a delivery crate for GSO, uh, which is over here. Uh, delivery crate up for grabs. BNIB delivery crate in condition, never opened, free to a good home, need to clear out space quick, so please come take this delivery crate off my hands. Still has one year warranty, no time wasters, please. You can easily tell that the developers of this game have fun with the descriptions. Um. I know the Megaton is the Megaton can's powerful, but my god. If it would just turn the tech into dust. There's just an ex just a big explosion and then there's just two pieces left. That And this tech just f literally just fell apart. Good holy hell. <laughs> Okay. One thing I honestly do hope that um, like when the uh, new update comes, is that Geocore gets their own um, radar. Poor company needs their own radar, believe me. Okay, back up a bit. Let the uh, SEO collect everything. Let's get 70 spotlights, why not? One. Two, three, four. There, now we can see better at night. And these will actually track the big boy. This spotlight will automatically search out nearby enemies to save you from nasty surprises. They do work. I th I'm not gonna lie on that, they do work. Not a, probably not the most effective thing in the world, but I mean, well, they do what they say. Yeah, it does what it says on the box. <laughs> but enemies also need to be in range in order for the uh, lights to detect it, so... Yeah, it does work. But, 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 by the time that the light detects the enemies, about half a second later, you're gonna, you're gonna be just <laughs> shot in the ass. Please tell me that this it's isn't a trap. This because, yeah. well, whether it is a trap or not, I kind of want to take out the ambushes. I ate way I, I I ate a bit too much for for dinner today, guys. So my stomach feels a little bit uneasy, uneasy. So if you guys happen to get an excessive amount of gas from me, I'm sorry. My stomach feels kind of weird too, so it's like the same. If I'm eating, I'm trying to settle it. Maybe I, I thought maybe I was just hungry. Uh. Uh, we don't exactly. Uh, what we need is something well, we don't we have. <laughs> well, we we do have, but it's all back at the base. Wireless chargers. That's what I was looking for. Uh. How the hell? 
Well, let's first take out this friggin' tree. Yeah, I used the uh, X1 flamethrower against a tree before. Tree no more! <laughs> Good god. Because I, I wanted to see... I said like... Because the script says like it's not good against mining or enemies so, or anything. I want to test the theory. Yeah. As I said, um, that last that last piece of line must have been written by Sundere because it's pretty freaking wow. good, especially once you get once you get enough of them. Good God. Wow. Come on. Guys, I don't... I hope... You don't hate me for this. Oh, Rhodite! Oh, no, Rhodite, dumbass. It's not Rhodite. Baka 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 Get over here! Oh god, that was good. Get over here! Get over here! Here we go. Oh, bitch. That works. If I'm, I must. If I must be honest, that every, works. Play if, if you play MK9, and you put Freddy Krueger against Scorpion. Scorpion's like, get over here, Freddy Krueger. Oh my god. Well, yeah, like a knee, and like like Scorpion needs to be more edgy. God. Oh, he, like oh, at this point, he must be on Edge Lord levels of edge. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, I got, I got, I got, um, Mortal Kombat fans pissed at me now. Because when I'm referring to Edgelord, I'm referring to Shadow the Hedgehog. You should see fucking Matt, uh, two best friends, fan artist Scorpion. Thank, yeah, he likes Spawn. I like Scorpion, but with, like, Spawn shit. That's edgy. Oh yeah, and I seen the video, for anyone wondering, I seen the video called Ow the Edge. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> That's literally all I, uh, all I could say, but uh oh. Shit, it's a trap, it's a trap, oh god. It's a trap! A little bit of a Star Wars reference if we can. I'm like getting shot in the ass. I'm gonna push you off the cliff. <laughs> you don't dunk it. Pain in the ass. That was one of the other this room this morning. I swear I got. I swear I got woke up by. So body woke up. Oh wow. That's a thing to get in your head first thing in the morning. Ooh, whoa. Whoa, he exploded. I was like, dude, you're, there is not Shrek playing in the other room right now. I was fucking dying this morning. Oh, 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 those are one of chargers. I want those. That tech has Geocore. This is going to do some Geocore Wireless tar char Targers? <laughs> Geocore Wireless Targers, we need those! Please tell me to survive. I'm gonna see if they pop up here in the pile. Um, guys, have a good look for them! Because I know there was a bunch of stuck on this tech over here. Come on. No, there's a saw blades! 
damn it. Well, you deserve to die even more for deceiving me, you jerk. Yeah, you want to deceive us? You die. My want to kill you rises even more. How the bloody bu- What the You expect us to go down there, you friggin' idiot! <sighs> Fine. We'll go down there, but you're gonna die. As I said... Oh, donkey's dead. And we left our master seal up top. Uh, why didn't I take it with me? Because I'm a friggin' dumbass. Get back over here. Okay. I find it funny, it's like the big boy wheel and big boy block. What the hell? I didn't even click outside my screen. Oh my god, really? Oh shit. Wait. Yeah, just go away. Thank you. I got being over... Overpowered and over by being overgraded, good lord. Oh, lovely. Hey now, you're a rock star. Get your game on, go. Get paid. <sighs> yeah, for anyone wondering what song is stuck in my head right now, it's that. I ain't the shopper's tool in the shed, which I'm actually kind of sur- Well, I'm surprised, and I'm not. Surprised at the same time that that's the actual name of the song. What in the hell? Thank you, Internet. I'm grateful for some of the things that the Internet has graced me with. That's not one of them. I thought that sound stopped working there for a second. I was like, what the hell? Ah, there we go. Okay, let's continue getting up this hill. I know this isn't exactly the most best way to get up it because it's like kind of cheating because we're floating up of it, floating up the mountain. But the thing is, with this being the red, red mountains, there's no real easy way to get, get up these. Unless you find a very, very specific and dignified path. Which even then again is not easy. We'll get the we'll get the stuff up here that's in the crate. Then we'll head down and pick up the stuff that's there on the ground. Only shooting stars may get the gold, but that doesn't mean I need to constantly hear it. <laughs> oh! Hello, Caterpillar Tracks! I love these! Yeah, that's the song I got curtain stuck in my head right now. Because F me! God's sake. On we go. This, you know, just plucks the, um, Mess uh, the Geocore Mesa CEO from the ground. Just go boop. boop. Uh, you're a rock star, get paid. Oh, 
me shooting stars. Get the oh, I'm gonna drop myself insane. <sighs> and I'm already out of it enough as it is. Uh, which you guys will probably be able to tell just by the sound of my voice. There's one thing I can honestly say I find a bit surprising. And... The... The, um... The, like, the larger venture wheels... And was it the monster truck wheels or whatnot? I, they, the... Oh, shit. They dis... They display... They display what I'm about to say very well. We'll deal with you in a second. By the bounciness. But, you would think... With all the rubber that's on these tires... You would think they'd be more squishy. Instead of just being all... Uh, <laughs> instead of just being all, like, st stiff like this. Uh, but then again, there's not very much rubber on these wheels, so... Well, you, well, you wouldn't expect them to be all uh, that squishy, but still. Squishy. Yes, for anyone wondering, I say squishy, like, squishy. squishy. If anyone is going to judge me for the way that I say squishy... Go... Uh, uh, meh. Squishy. Because I've, I've been saying squishy like that ever since I was a kid. Uh, I've been saying that uh, in saying that in real life ever since I was a kid. That's special. And so, like I said, if any of you, if any of you guys are gonna judge me, Don't meh, me. meh. That's just how I speak. Damn it. And now this guy's trying to go over the top with it. It's best you don't go over the top with the squishy. <laughs> or that might happen to you. I don't even know what you call that. You're the invader? Are you serious? I can easily take care of you! I don't need the GF4 build for you. But I would like to say some of those fuel cont- Never mind I'm trying to save some of those fuel containers. Because you just end up turning yourself into a big bomb. You are a GSO turbine propeller, and you are grade three. Wait a minute. If that's grade three, how come we haven't come across any yet in the shop? That does not make any sense. We're GSO grade four. Well, these tires here are actually a good example. Because, I mean, these tires, they look and have the feeling of being rigid. Being rigid. Whoa, guys, I have Whoa. no God. idea what in the world just happened to my voice when it came back through the, uh, through the Squid's headphones. I don't know what happened, but it completely glitched out. Uh, what did I do? My voice came through your headphones again. I don't know what to do about that, it just like happens. 
Yeah, that, that's what that's what I mean by reverb. I don't know how to turn that off. It just randomly fucking happens, dude. Because I know it, because I know it's that's been. Don't tear my wheel off. Oh, don't rip my wheels off. So I know it's just been happening for like the past what, five or six videos. Sorry, I wish I knew what to do. Okay, um, how many, um, do, do we have the, uh, we got five 4X Mega Boosters. Mega Boosters. Oh, I say Redux Mega Boosters, are you serious? No, stick it in the right way, you dumbass. You had it right the first time, you friggin' idiot! Thank you. There we go. Oh, and we got a couple extra big Papa fuel tanks. Mm. Well, if we want to go fast, well, we'll certainly be able to do that. Can you stop trying to give me a heartburn? Seriously, stop it. A uh, wave of bullies defend tech for a duration of attack. Okay. What's our what's our better situation here on the uh GSO tech? Okay, so the battery's about half full and how about you, Geocore? Your battery's like a little less than half. Uh, oh good, 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 sun's coming up. Because I, I heard the shields reactivate. Um, okay. I don't know why the camera just did that, it did that on its own. Uh... That was a sneeze, so I just muted. I don't want you guys to go deaf. <laughs> oh, hi, S uh, Ice Cream S is Sunday. Hi, Jack the guy. <laughs> That's still awesome that they did that. <laughs> you game developers are amazing. <laughs> like, seriously. What exactly did we get? A bunch of saw blades? Yep, let me see. Geocore bus us crap. Uh, I read a fire low focus, I recorded this thing is a beast. <laughs> like I said, the developers of this game, you could tell they had fun making this game. And you guys have been wondering, why am I taking the, uh, the Geocore tech for the, um, Wave of Bullies? Uh... The Megaton Cadden will give us an edge. Oh, it's just over here. And one thing I honestly find awesome is for any of you guys who have heard of the name 
U Uber Hexanova. But he actually did the voice of the pogo guy from Happy Wheels. I'm not even kidding. Br brunch trumpet. I love these names. <laughs> Uh, I'm not being sarcastic, I, I do love these names, they're rather creative. And fight fire with fire, so... Alright, that's why I picked the, uh, Geocortex. Fight a Geocortex with a Geocortex! Even though we got XP for a GSO for that, because I had a GSO cap. What the hell? So these freaking bills have GSO caps. Why is it the one here with a Geocore cap? What the hell? Well, dead rides. Oh. oh, there we go. He had a Geocore cap and you got GSO. Yep. That's sick. Nah. Really? Game says a freaking gnat at us. Oh my sweet lord, what the hell is that? Just, what is that? Pain cushion! Sweet god, that looks like a... That looks like a... That looks like a amusement park right from hell. <laughs> Good God! Like one of those things that you uh, sit in the seat and you go around like a central uh, central column. One of those things. That's what it looks like. I was watching Benji in an ink machine. Okay. That's what made me think of it. Yeah, I. I I'm watching that Jacksepticeye play it. Okay, you got the range, you got the range. Okay. Mission complete! Booyah! Let's see what we get. Oh! Yes! 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 Got another wireless charger, sweet! I would do the... Well, I'd do what Jacksepticeye did and when it was Happy Wiz videos where he said yes uh, three times but each time he said it was la uh, a lot louder and a lot longer. The thing is I got people living with I I got pe I got people living with me, and so I don't want to disturb them, and I don't want to make you guys deaf. And me deaf. Yeah, because apparently my apparently my squeaks can be can be lethal to the ears, from what this guy's told me. Get in the proper spot, you idiot! Ah! Okay, why are you doing that? There! Pain in the ass! Okay, so we still got Master Harvester 2. I don't know why I just suddenly stopped. I'm still holding down the W key. And we got Bird of Prey. Hmm. 
I'll check out the uh, mission board. See what's there. Well, I think I might know what we're gonna do next time. And what are we gonna do next time? Well, I'm sorry, but you guys are gonna have to wait till next time. Okay, let's park up here. Up here. Um. Okay, let's go to our base. <laughs> Okay. There we go. Okay, let's see what's in the shop real quick. <laughs> as as our G core tech just parks up there in the bottom right hand corner. It's a large engine just purring away. We could use another one of these, so I'm taking another one of these. Saying you in here for the time being. Okay, let's check the mission board. While the game breaks. Okay. Oh, oh, you guys see this? The next time, looks like we're going to be flying legit or uh, legitly. So, it looks like tomorrow is going to be a rather fun episode. It's time you earn your wings and learn how to fly. We'll have to fly and tech nearby. Go grab it. Well. As I said, that's gonna have to be left for, la for next time. Oh, I'm going to love next video. I hope you guys are too. So, guys, enough of my teasing. Um, press but the like button if you guys enjoyed, and we'll see you in the next one. Later, guys. Oh, next episode might be my favorite one yet, and you guys are going to see why.